Hey, I'm Stephanie Pressman here at the Paley Center celebrating the 25th anniversary of China Beach. We'll be talking to some of the cast, so stick around. Stephanie. Hi, Stephanie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. I had the pleasure of, uh, of being a nurse once on ER. So. Oh, oh, that's, that's <laughs> great. That was, that was another really good experience for me. I was a lucky guy, yeah. So 25 years later, how do you think TV's changed over the those years? Well, I mean, the simplest answer to that is they, they wouldn't make China Beach today. Well, maybe on cable, on a cable channel, but no network would, would touch this. And certainly uh, uh, a lot of the episodes, they just wouldn't do them. They wouldn't do the abortion episode. They would have cut way down on the, uh, uh, the, the blood and gore and the and, and, you know, for shame that we should make uh, war look unappealing. You know, they just, it just wouldn't fly. So I, I think it was historic and really, uh, I'm really proud that I was part of it. What was the experience, how, how did the experience differ between China Beach and ER? Well, uh, first of all, with China Beach, uh, I, you know, I'm, I'm a Vietnam vet. So China Beach was a, was a special, it was important to me to be able to play that character and to, and to inform that with things that I actually knew. And uh, ER was, was wonderful, but it, you know, it was a big, um, uh, very, uh, it was fantastic, but it was a big slick production compared with, with China Beach where, that was almost guerrilla filmmaking. And we, we were just out in the mud and, and working. So, you know, some days where I remember one day it was 28 hours, and you know that would never happen on ER, and it would never happen on any TV set today. You know, it just they just pull the plug. You know, so. Where do you think your character would be 25 years in the future? Well, uh, 20 from now or from then. From then. oh, from then. Uh, well, I think Bub Pepper would be. Uh, retired and volunteering at a VA. That's that's what I think. I think he'd, he'd be probably retired in Missouri and going down to the VA two days a week and answering phones. That's what I think. So if there's people out there that haven't seen the show, it's coming out on DVD soon, are, what would you tell them about the show so that they would tune in and watch? I, I would say it's probably the most uh, beautiful story of of sacrifice and caring uh, that they'll ever see, and they, and they really ought to give it a spin. Well, thank you so much. Thanks, thanks for taking the time. And we'll look for it on DVD. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure if you liked what you saw, you click like. If you want to see more interviews like this, click subscribe and leave us a comment telling us what your favorite medical drama is. And we'll see you later. Bye.